Here, uh, we have a SAP math question. Okay, let's go over the question. On Friday, Jan is uh, read X pages every 30 minutes for four hours. Uh, Kim read Y pages every 15, min every 15 minutes for five hours. Which of the following represents the total number of pages read by Janice and Kim on Friday? Okay, first let me take uh, Janice. So Janice uh, uh, read uh, X pages every 30 minutes. So in 30 minutes time duration, uh, Janice read X pages. Okay, so but uh, she read uh, X pages every 30 minutes for the time duration of four, four hours. So we have to convert this uh, time duration to hours. So here it's already 30 minutes. If I want to convert this one to hours, it has to become 60 minutes. So if it becomes 60 minutes, uh, we can write it as one hour. So if I want to make this one as 60 minutes, I have to multiply this by two. So I multiply uh, both sides by two. So two times 30 is uh, 60 minutes. And two times x pages is two x pages. So uh, 60 minutes, instead of 60 minutes, we can write one hour. So Jan is read one hour, in one hour, uh, Jan is read two x pages. Okay, so but I have to find how many pages uh, Jan is read in four hours. So already we know the number of pages read by Jan is in one hour. So to know the number of pages read by Jan is in four hours, I have to multiply both the quantities by four. So four times one is four hours. On the right side, four times two x is eight x pages. Okay, so Jan is read eight x uh, number of pages in four hours. In the same way, we have to find the number of pages read by Kim in five hours. So then we have to uh, add both the quantities uh, to find the total number of pages read by Janice and Kim. Okay, now let's do working for uh, Kim. Okay, Kim uh, read um, Y pages every 15 minutes. Okay, if I want to convert this one to us, uh, it has to be 60 minutes because if we have 60 minutes, we can write it as one hour. So if I want to make this 15 as 60, I have to multiply by four. So I'm going to multiply both sides by four. Four times 15 is 60 minutes. Four times y is four y pages. Okay, instead of writing 60 minutes, we can write as one hour. In one hour, we have four y pages. Okay, so but uh, okay, Kim uh, read four y pages in one hour, but I want to find the number of pages read by Kim in five hours. So for that, I have to multiply uh, both sides by five. So five times one is, uh, we have five hours on the left side. Here, five times four y is 20 y pages. So uh, the number of pages uh, read by Kim in five hours is 20 y. Okay, now I got uh, for both Janice and Kim, I mean, uh, the number of pages read by Janice in four hours, eight, eight X pages. And the number of pages uh, read by Kim in five hours is 20 Y pages. So the total number of pages, the total number of pages read by uh, both Janice and Kim on Friday is eight X positive 20 Y. So the correct answer choice is option B.